that Moi has desperately manipulated the Electoral Commission to rig election in his favor in order to declare himself the president, we categorically reject the provisional results of the presidential elections. People know that they voted to reject the incumbent and put in place a president and a government they will have faith in. That is why they have elected me as the president. It is clear that the constitutionally sanctioned process of electing a new set of leaders to take us to the next level has been thwarted by another tainted election. This team has failed. It is the machine that is voting. We therefore reject all the... Barely two hours before his announcement, Mr. Bukati called a meeting of the IEBC and revealed to them the different results was going to announce. Four of the seven protested Mr. Chebukati's actions. And Mr. Chebukati, whose mind appeared made up, did not entertain any discussion of the results, precipitating a walkout by a majority of the commissioners who promptly denounced the results at a press conference. We know what happened next. A majority of the commissioners walked out and held a press conference where they denounced the results. Our view in Azimio is clear. The figures announced by Mr. Chibukati are null and point. I repeat, the figures announced by Mr. Chibukati are null and point and must be quashed by a court of law. In our view, there's neither a legally and validly declared winner nor a president-elect. Mr. Chibukati's announcement purporting to announce a winner is a nullity. He acted with gross impunity and in total disregard of the Constitution and our laws. He could have plunged our country into chaos but our supporters not exercise great restraint. Such blunt and acts of impunity can be a threat to the security of our country. It is not up to us to decide whether Mr. Chibukati has committed an offense. We leave that determination to the appropriate authorities.